Alright guys, this is a how-to video for beginners to get started in soldering, just showing some of the items I use. Um, first is my Radio Shack soldering iron. It uses four AA batteries. It was about $29 from uh, my local Radio Shack. Uh, you gotta push the button down to get it to heat up, so it does take a little while longer than a traditional you know, plug-in type that stays hot. Uh, Next up is just some use some rosin core solder as the type of solder that you want to use. Um, the thickness can be whatever you feel like using. I like to use a pretty thin wire. This is tenor cleaner for your soldering iron. I highly recommend it. You just stick the uh, tip of the soldering iron in there and it cleans it up. As well as a damp sponge which you will use frequently to wipe off the excess solder. Um, I like to use gloves just because it keeps your finger oil off of the soldering tip which causes a lot of problems. A pair of uh, wire cutters or dykes is a good thing to have. Just uh, all around good for anything. I also, instead of like a lot of various clamps, I really like to use these little mini vice grips because they can clamp onto virtually any kind of different thing. Um, you can adjust the size, it's heavy, works well. I have a bunch of other various clamps too, including alligator clips. You're going to definitely need a pair of wire strippers. Um, doesn't matter what kind, just something that will strip all kind of different wire. Uh, it's definitely a must have. The other thing you're going to need is, you're going to need a lot of heat shrink tubing, depending on what you're doing. Um, I like to pretty much put heat shrink tubing on everything I'm doing 